Alright guys, I'm going to enter the tournament. I'm going to tell you a little bit about it as we go. I wanted an opportunity to show you all the way th the tournament setting works when battling other Digimon in the arena. The way it works is that you enter a tournament to win items or prize money. Uh, how well you do in these tournaments depends on how well you've trained your Digimon. You have to have your Digimon equipped with techniques that you can only get access to in here. You cannot use recovery items, and you have 99 seconds to defeat your opponent. As I said just now, you cannot recover MP even between rounds. This is something that was fixed in the in one of the later entries, Digimon World Redigitized, the reboot of the series. I hope they fix this in next order. So yeah, um, you can still issue commands, and you can't quit or run from the battle. Oh, and there is a two-player mode in this game. I might be tempted to show it off. It's basically the same thing uh, with the arena. The arena is two-player, just so I'm being crystal clear. I just need one more hit and I'll be fine. As for the arena, there are three rounds. You have to make it from the beginner round to the intermediate and to the advanced, well, to the finals. You won't be competing against every other Digimon. There is no losers bracket. So what you'll be doing is basically wait, wait to take your place in the, the semi-finals and on the finals onward. I would have liked to have battled Saber Jamon, but now I get Shellmon. Oh, this arena is hosted by Greymon, but there are many different Digimon that compete. Oh, there is some healing between the rounds, but you can't heal the Digimon yourself. And the healing won't really be heavy. It's a light amount of MP recovered and HP as well. And as I was saying before, sorry, I lost track of thought, my track of thought. Um, I guess any of the other mechanics involved? No, I can't really think of any right now. Um, basically, there are certain Digivolution items you can gain from this tournament as you progress through all the different all the different competitions. Uh, right now, we're in the champion competition, which Metal Greymon really shouldn't be a part of, but I've seen the ultimate Digimon rounds in this game. They are not to be taken lightly. And right now, my Digimon strength, um, it kind of, I would say, pales in comparison to others at the moment. I wonder if I can still defend. Yeah, I can still defend. You know, there's a lot of flaws with this version of things, with this version of the arena. If I could fix, I would. Oh, I love that. I love that this liquid crystallization actually paid off for me. Okay, I beat him. Awesome. Oh, yeah, and there, of course, the timer. It, whoever has the most health at the end of the timer wins. I don't know if you could do a draw here. There's a chance that that might be it. Or, like, if you draw with someone, you just might lose the competition. Like, not, no one will win. And the tournament will either be over, or I, I don't know. I, I can't really remember, recollect. I don't know if I ever got that far. Now I'm going up against Koilamon. I wonder what I'll win. Because these prizes can be anything. It can be food, it can be recovery items, it can be Digivolution items, it can be money. 
I mean, if my Digimon's gonna die eventually, I may as well go out with a bang. I didn't know Quillamon had poison attacks. I mean, he's more of a water Digimon than anything. Water, ice, and poison, it seems. Okay, now I have him at a disadvantage. I just need to get one more strike. Maybe one more if I'm lucky. Because that poison is going to do a lot of damage. And Quillamon's attack animation is much faster than Metal Greymon's. Ooh, yeah, this is, this is not good. Let's see if I can still win. Okay, here's hoping. I'm gonna keep my fingers crossed. Okay, one more. Okay, I won. But just by the hair, if you ask me. I really need to train my Digimon to become a lot stronger. Which will occur in future videos. Metal Greymon, we are the champions! Okay, I don't know the rest of the lyrics to that song, so I will not continue with that. I'll be lucky if I can continue one more day, and I have an idea as to where I want to go. Three sirloins. Let's see. Okay, so I can still live. My Digimon can still, you know, can still roam f alive and free. This is good. I want to go to the toilet and then I'll have a rest. Yeah, one thing you don't want to do is go to sleep without checking your Digimon stats to see if he needs to go to the toilet or anything. Uh, because it, if you go to sleep and he goes to the bathroom outside of where he needs to go, it brings down your discipline and happiness by a lot. Enough to make you <laughs> regret getting new Mamon as a Digivolution. Depending on whether your Digimon is a rookie or whatnot. Well, okay. I guess we can continue onward by going... Let's see where. I have a list in front of me, but where do I want to go? I guess one place I could go to... Let me save the game first, I mean... Yeah. I, I think it would be a good idea if I did. Tamer levels, this is done. Euromon has new rumors. Okay. I wonder why my, why my Digimon has been alive for so long. It, this doesn't really feel usual. I mean, the Digimon, the Digimon dies this, uh, really quickly when one stops to think about it. Get up very early and walk in the mist. Something good will happen. And how many bits do I have? Okay, so I have enough to get by. I guess I'll just stock up on items and then I'm going to go to the winter wonderland of the digital world, which is known as Freeze Land. I'll go and explore the area a bit. I have to go to bed soon, so I'll only have enough time to make two videos for now. And as for everything else, I guess I don't need them. So far, this looks like a good stock of items.
Okay, so what I'm going to do next... Let's go to Freeze Land. Yeah, uh, you could go walk many, many miles toward the Great Canyon of the digital world, but I'd, re I'd rather just shortcut this and take Bergermont. Yeah, this will take you back to the area of the top elevator, I mean, of the elevator uh, near Bergermont's nest. What you need to do is take the bridge going, I don't know what direction it is, but it's on the left corner of the screen. So it's basically time to explore Freeze Land. Where Metal Greymon is not really subjugated to that much to that much cold, so let's explore. I feel like I should have read the sign back there. Got to be careful when walking here, because some of the Digimon might appear from uh, might appear from out of nowhere, just like that. See if I can feed him the Digi Mushroom to get rid of them. That's what I love about Metal Greymon and having him. He's kind of a Digimon that has that isn't really that hungry. I mean, I know I went over that in the previous videos. If Metal Greymon, whoop, sorry. If Metal Greymon is a virus type Digimon, I don't think he'll be allowed into the Ice Sanctuary. The Ice Sanctuary is the light counterpart to the Grey Lord's Mansion. I mean, I suppose it can't hurt to go look. Let's see if they'll let us in. Uh, although I don't believe so. I'll explain more about the mansion once I get there. Yes, where we're going to is, is resembles a mansion. Normally, in the Grey Lord's Mansion, you, if you arrive there with anything but a virus Digimon, you are not allowed inside. You are stopped by a strange black force. Over here, you are stopped by a strange white force, simply because Metal Greymon is not a, vi a vaccine or data type. Although I don't know which type it is specifically that is required by the game's own standard to get you into that domain. You know, some of the environments in Next Order look a lot like these. So, you might want to be careful, you guys, if you play the game. Let's see if we can avoid him. Oh boy. Boss battle! And with what space? I can barely move anywhere. Yeah, um, that was an interesting move that this blue recolor of Ogremon managed to pull. I think that might be the Buster Dive. Yeah, yeah, that's the Buster Dive. It's a head-on tackle move. Alright, there we go. I love this music. What did Hyde Yogamon drop? Sirloin. Okay, cool. Great Canyon, a sanctuary, the rest of Freeze Land. Okay. So we've already gone in two directions. Let's go into the third. I do know what's up ahead, and I am interested in another battle. Maybe I could fight the three of them. Oh, it's only just one. Alright, after this battle I'm going to just cut the video off and go exploring a little more.
Although I am hoping to adopt the Buster Dive as a new technique, but it's all a game of luck. Let's see if one more hit is all it takes to win. Alright guys, see you in the next part. Misty Trees, Iceberg Beach. I wonder where to go.